So I modified the microphone on the Akaso V50 Elite. I used the Dremel tool to make a larger port where the microphone is. And on top of the microphone there was felt that was glued onto the top of the microphone. I think that's where the problem is, is how they applied the felt to the top of the microphone. We got some pretty decent audio and I'll play a clip for you. What I usually do after I make a port is I cover it up with uh, foam. The type of foam that I use to cover up the microphone port is just ordinary packing foam, but it has to be the open cell packing foam. I'll cut a piece and apply it on the camera. Okay, that's the final project right there. That's what it looks like. You can shape that piece of foam all you want. And basically all you're going to achieve is aesthetics. It just will look different. Um, the size is probably more important than the shape. But you can take all the points off of it, but I don't think that'll matter though. Because I don't think it makes any more noise or any less noise. It works pretty good. I put a windscreen on just about every camera that I use for mountain biking. It is just, it's almost essential to put a windscreen on it. Okay, hope that helps you guys. Bye.